Hello everyone, this is Miss Yali from Twin Rivers Branch. Welcome to Makerspace. This is week 8 of Makerspace. Uh, today we are going to pick a quick and easy fun craft. Uh, we will make a fun magical bookmark. We will make these unicorn bookmarks with a yarn tassel. And it will be like this. So, let's get started. We will need just a few things for this craft, some yarn of any color of choice, a scissor, a hole punch, and some cardstock and a pencil. Okay, you can print this template if you have a printer available. Uh, you can find the template in the description below, or you can look at this outline and draw it at the back on the back side of the cardstock or you can print it on a plain copy paper and cut it out and uh, trace it back on at the back of the glitter cardstock or any kind of fun cardstock if you are using you can also draw it on a white cardstock and color it in a way you like it it's a very easy outline drawing so you can look at it like if you are watching this video on a tablet or a phone just freeze the screen for a while and look at it and try to um, make the same shape it's free and it, it's a very easy drawing you can draw it you don't need a printer for this but if you want to print it you can do it too so this is how i drew my unicorn so in the glitter cardstock i just cut it on the lines if i'm printing it on a plain cardstock or some other paper i like to have the black outline around it but it's up to you if you don't like the outline just cut it on the line and get rid of it and it's very easy to cut and super fun and quick project you can make several of them you can give it to friends and family or you can have several of it and unicorns are the cutest magical creature ever see the glitter makes it look so cool you can also cut it on white cardstock and put glitter on it i'm just punching a hole at the back to attach the tail for the tail i'm just using a box of crayon like a pencil box you can use a cardstock or your hand or just we need something uh, to wrap the yarn around like a rectangular thing just i like to take all the three strands of yarn together three four whatever colors i'm using together and wrap it that's how it mixes well like it looks it blends better so wrap it for a little while, like not too many times, just a few times. And then take a small piece of yarn and hold it and tie it. This will help us attach this tassel to the unicorn body. And now we will make this into a tassel, like the fancy kind, <laughs> nothing fancy, just a simple way. Take another piece of yarn and tie it. Make sure the yarn which you are using to tie it to the unicorn doesn't get tied in that knot. It's easy peasy. Just tie your knots very hard and like several times so that it doesn't come out. Trim the bottom, make it how long you want or how short you want, it's up to you, okay? Our tassel is all ready. Now we will add the tail to the unicorn. Just I like to thread the yarn from the front of the unicorn body so that I can tie it at the back and I can hide my knot at the back of the body. I like to lay it down on the table. It, it I just find it very helpful. That way I can tie like very tight knot and it will be flat and nice. Cut the excess yarn and your bookmark is all ready. It was easy and quick. So here are my several of bookmarks. It's very hard to stop at one. Once you start making it, you would like to make it all. 
uh, all the colors of the rainbow. So you can, if you don't want the unicorn body to show, you can just put it like that. And I like when the unicorn head um, peeks out of my book and the tassel is there. It's super fun and cute. If you want, you can draw, make designs, put names of the thing. So here are my unicorns. Hope you like this craft and you will give this unicorn bookmark a try. Uh, you can find the template um, printable in the description below. Uh, thanks for stopping by. I will see you next week with a new fun new craft. Until then, enjoy summer.